As it is a global art project that just went up today. People don't always like talking about death, but November is National Hospice and Palliative Care Month. So by talking about what you want to do before you die, it starts the conversation. Some people wrote wishes, others wrote out their bucket list. They're all answering the same question. Before I die, before I die, before I die. The sentence starts with three short words. How it ends is up to you. Before I die, I want to travel the world. I'd like to visit every continent. I want to be in a movie. All the national parks. Oh. That sounds good. You going to take me with you? Yeah. <laughs> Certainly something to, to do before the end. How many have you visited so far? Two, so I've got a long way to go. <laughs> oh. Alaska, cruise, amen. What do you want to do before you die? It took me a minute to answer that question. Happy and fulfilling yeah. life, adopt a pet. See my grandchildren, definitely. See the end of racism and intolerance. I mean, we're all gonna die someday. This is a, a catalyst that's not necessarily intimidating. Karen Rubel with Nathan Adelson Hospice helped bring this global art project to downtown Summerlin. So we celebrate births all the time, right? There's a lot of excitement around the birth of someone, but we don't necessarily um, celebrate death or really talk about. Until it's too late. Um, it's really important, I think, for us to educate the community about the benefits of hospice, the benefits of palliative care. You don't want to be making those decisions in the emergency room. Death puts life in perspective. My son had a thing when he was seven years old, and he said, uh, you know, um, when you die, you really, you really become alive no matter what age. I've had a friend pass away, so like that made me think about life and how short it actually can be. Death doesn't scare everyone. To me, I look forward to, you know, that mm -hmm. golden highway and yeah. my mansion in heaven. But it can be hard to talk about. Instead of talking about death, write about how you want to live. Let's, let's go do as much as we can. Let's yeah. just keep going and enjoy yeah. life to the fullest. Yeah because you just never know. So if you want to come check out the art exhibit or maybe add your own note, this will be up through the weekend and then next week it moves to UNLV. Reporting live, Kyla Gaylor, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.